Welcome to another video by Into Fly Fishing. In this video, it's our last day here at Jurassic Lake Lodge on Lago Strobel in Argentina. And we're really sad that this is gonna be our last session of fishing. We just finished up a break. We had some lunch, it was about a three hour rest. And now we're heading out to the aquarium. If you guys tuned into the previous episodes, you'll see we've been at aquarium a couple times and it's just a beautiful massive pool on the Barren Coastal River with some massive trout in there and we've pulled some great ones out. I'm hoping to pull some even bigger ones out tonight, but I'm just stoked to get to this river and get fishing again and share it with you guys. Enjoy. <laughs> yeah, nice fish. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Look at the colors again. I love these fish in the river. Nice. Perfect. What a perfect first fish. Sure, thanks, buddy. <laughs> All right guys, as always, I'm gonna talk about the gear that I'm using today. Today I'm using the Snowbee Spectre RMX seven weight, 10 foot fly rod. And even when I was casting this down at those massive trout at the Bay of Pigs off those rocks, we had like 100 kilometer an hour winds and I was still able to fire this line out there, which is pretty incredible. I also have their Spectre number seven, eight reel. This is the cassette reel. I love this thing. It's super handy to have all the different cassettes with different types of line on it. I also have the Snowbee Prestige GXS 5 weight 9 foot fly rod and you wouldn't think that you'd be using a 5 weight here at Jurassic Lake Lodge but sometimes it's nice to cast those really tiny little dry flies and catch an enormous trout on them on these waters out here like at the aquarium we had in previous episodes. And lastly I'm wearing the Yeti Panga backpack. This thing's a fishing backpack. It's airtight, watertight, so you can literally walk in above your chest and this thing will not fill up with water, which is really, really nice. So that's all the gear I'm using. Let's get back to fishing on the aquarium. Start to the last day at Jurassic Lake Lodge on Lago Strobel. Let's get another one. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's big. I think that's the guy I just saw come up a second ago. Don't come at me. Don't come right at me. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's the fish I saw. Wicked. Oh, big fish. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Rado, for this fly that he tied this morning. That's a big fish. That's a really big fish. Oh, he's 
coming right in for the landing. Yeah! <laughs> Woo -hoo! Wow, that was like maybe three or four casts and I've already got two big fish in here. Uh, that second one even bigger, both males. And the first one took a little black nymph, maybe like a size 10 or 12, that Ratto tied this morning. And it was the same, the same fly that was catching all those big trout at the last place we were at, at the Bay of Pigs in the morning. Um, but yeah, the second one took the leech, a black leech with a bead head. And it's just awesome in here. Like the wind's howling, but the casts are working. We're getting them out there and then hooking into some big, big, big trout. So, loving it. Let's get back on the water. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Good size. <laughs> Good size. Oh, yeah, it's good fish. Yeah, it's big. Is there anything to worry about on that side? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, damn. He was big. Is it Rado's fault? I gotta check the knot. Oh, it's not Rado's fault. The fly is there. Oh, he was big. some wine thinking that this wasn't that big of a fish and then holy Surprise beast at the end of the day. Cheers, buddy. Nice. That is an amazing fish for in here. Oh, look at the size of that tail, dude. Huge. 
So, <laughs> uh, we were thinking about going back to the Bay of Pigs because this pool had slowed down a little bit. And then, just on this little tiny creek part of the river that looks like some tiny backwoods creek, this big, big rainbow took that. And did he take the San Juan? No, the orange the, leech. The orange leech, and he took an orange leech. Uh, that's awesome. Wow. Okay, what a fish. Oh, yes. All right, so that was an end of the day fish that we didn't really expect, uh, but I'm super happy that we came out here. What a day of fishing. This is the best day of fly fishing of my life. And I know that I say that every day here on Lago Strobel in Argentina, but really one day after another just got better and better. If you guys didn't have a chance, go back and check out the last episode. There were even bigger trout and the episodes before that, there were so many beautiful spots that we went to all around Jurassic Lake Lodge. And it really is the most phenomenal fly fishing spot, I think in the world, definitely for the sheer number and enormous trout that they have here. It's really hard to beat anywhere else, but I just had a blast. This was my favorite fly fishing trip of my life. Rado was an incredible guide this entire time, putting me on fish over and over and over again. And wow, I'm just blown away by this place. Patagonia, baby. I gotta come back here for sure. But that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below and make sure you subscribe. It really helps out the channel. Plus we're gonna be doing a lot more of these vlog videos like this. So until next time, tight lines.